Oh my god. Let's start off every video by me rubbing something out of my eye. <sighs> Wonderful. Okay. Hello. Hello. I'm Heidi Klum from Project One. Hi, welcome to part two of our huge, amazing, like amazing, um, bins haul. Oh my god. If you guys didn't know, we're in Minnesota for like... There's a motorcycle, sorry. And again, like I said, we're outside, so natural noises may happen. No, it, was a, it wasn't even a motorcycle. But we put the pox okay. inside so there'll be no barking. But yeah, we're in Minnesota, like one last big shebang for the summer because Ryan's school will be starting soon. Monday, August 26th. I'm Thanks not in school me. anymore. <laughs> um, but I mean, obviously we're still gonna come up here so there's still like tons of calls nope. and stuff coming. We're but like coming this, ever is, again. this is our last summer period. period. Um, yeah, ever. Um, but yeah, okay. we're just gonna jump back into it. And like I said in the first video, I've got a Gucci that I found at the bins. So like, keep watching to see that yeah i don't got none of that but like i got a bag full of stuff <laughs> okay pardon me i forgot two shoes from the first one but in the bag show the bag you're into. <gasps> okay if any of you are minnesotans or just like or me. just watch news and like somehow knew this happened it's the mpr raccoon which is the Minnesota Public Radio Raccoon. He climbed to the if top you of didn't the know, there is this raccoon <laughs> in Minnesota who climbed the NPR building. Which is like a He just like scaled the wall and he got up on this like multiple story building and he was just at the top like He made it all the way to the top. Like he made it all the way to the and top. And he was like building. peeking. And then obviously he was stuck. Like he didn't want to climb down. <laughs> so literally like it was this huge like news thing that happened in Minnesota. And they got him down. And they got him down. Which is I great. think they had to sedate him because they didn't want rabies, but like he's okay and he's they let him go. living and his life now. But I am so happy so I found cute. this. That's so cute. Um yeah, but the two shoes that I forgot. Okay, anyway, not raccoons. Are these really cute ones, which some lady didn't want, don't know why. Thanks, other ladies. Zara Basic, size 38. Not Nothing wrong with them. I think they're really cute. Mm -hmm. Oh, I mean, that's some, like, scrapage, but, like, I don't know. I've sold Zara shoes with some... Scrapage. Yeah. <laughs> um, a classic, but not a favorite. We stand. I, I don't. He doesn't stand. He stands some dance goes. Somebody watch goes. Um, if you can see, yes, there's like embossed pattern, of course, there's some wear, but like with dance goes, for the country, you don't care. That's it for shoes. I don't have any more shoes on there. So this is nope. old label cabbie. It's five years old. <laughs> um, I love tweed, so I got this. <laughs> Tweed's really okay. what? I really wish this like wasn't anything good. And just, I like tweed. I like tweed. Tweed's really cute. So like I had to get this. It's and a like good old cabby tag. Um, usually the jackets are really cropped. This one's not. So Thank I liked it a lot. God. Like. Yes. I found a North Face men's oh, it's like just a like black quarter zip. Maybe needs a little detailing. I thought it was like a jacket when you showed this mm -mm. to me. Hmm. And I don't know what it's made of, but. Sweater. Okay. It's made out of sweater material. You know, yarn. And number five. Oh, I, I love this. Ryan skipped it because he didn't like it. So this I'm gonna send to the real real. I don't know why it has so many red strings. But if mm -hmm. they don't want it for some reason, I am not mad about selling it. Oh my god, it. there's so many. It's Sport by Obermeyer, which yeah. Obermeyer is a really expensive kind of North Face type brand. They're feathers. And the Real Real always takes it. Look at this. It's so ugly. It's cute. I love this. Perfect for winter. It's like an ugly sweater. Oh, I love it. It's so cute. It's a. Oh. Um, I was gonna say your it's turn. A picnic print, but it's not a picnic print. Okay. Uh, so as we were leaving, I saw this, and I said, oof, I don't know what that is, hopefully, it's Lululemon or Iviva, and I, it was the latter. Which, Sorry if it's a little, like, foggy, funky. it's because the sun's up here, gotta, it's not because I have a smudge on my camera. No. Um, so I found a pair of the leggings in a size 14, and I found, oh, I was like, we will be taking these to Lululemon to get fixed. That's no problem. They need this some um, stitching repair. Yes. They're cute so, though. I like the pattern on these and especially with like Iviva stuff, I will not sell it. 
separately just because like I believe it's so hard to sell. It's irritating. Um so I'll sell them as a set. Um okay, next is this new tag little croppity toppity. It's just from Fashion Nova, but like Fashion Nova is a pretty quick sell for me for like obviously not that much. It was thirty four and ninety nine and it's called the way I like it top. And there is a matching skirt out there somewhere if you so desire. So Okay. Next, this uh, was little uh, Iva Viv's mom donated this, and I said, thank you, ma'am. It is a cute little Luli Lou Lemon tank top with the built-in bra. Wow, me going like this is showing me the built-in bra. Built-in bra, no problem. Um, and this is a size six, and it's new, because the new as a serial number. The new Lulu the new Lulu Lou lemons have all this gunk going on. Yeah. Gunk meaning like they got letters and stuff. Yeah. Okay. Two, three, four. Okay. Oh, next. Um. Oh, this is a big one. Can you hold that part? And I'll do this part. Okay. So this is a jumpsuit. It is Zara knit size medium, and it's this like really pretty, really fun. Little gray jumpsuit. The little, yeah, it's cute. It's little a wrap tie, jumpsuit. Little tie in the back. She got pockets. I don't want to snag it. Okay. Okay. I, I found this I'm, hat and I didn't know what line of Ralph Lauren it was. I just thought it was cute. Ralph Lauren stuff. If it's a hat, it does pretty good. Um, but it's that polo Ralph Lauren, and this is actually Ralph Lauren Country, which in the bolo video I Whoa. said to look out for. You can tell it's higher end because of all the like little detail everywhere. Um, a trick to finding the Ralph Lauren Country, it doesn't always say country, but it always says this quality dry goods thing. Mm -hmm. This is like a really nice leather patch. I saw someone selling this for like 50 for a hat. So like, excited about that. This country stuff is uh, His country stuff is like runway. It's expensive. <laughs> this, by the time that this gets posted, I might know what brand this is, but as of right now, I do not. We got no idea. This is like literally like a receipt from CVS. Um, oh, don't do CVS. Huh? This is um, Anthropology. What brand? Good question. Mm -hmm. But it's this tied, belted, um, like wool Sweater. sweater. It has like. On the buttons, it has like two geese and like dandelions. They're cute. But yeah, there's no words anywhere on this tag. It's but just I mean, little illustrations. Next, as Ryan would say, Nick. is a North Face fleece. A North Face. Full face. zip. Really needs to be washed. It is, if you can see that, there's hair, probably some of it being my pug's hair. Mm. It's all okay. over it, so let's wash that guy. This is a free people. Um, it's like a uneven hem, it's cute and though. the like ribbing switches directions halfway. I feel like I've sold this sweater before. Oh, there are a few stains, so we're gonna see. We got a little stain if that can come out. But like problem. free people sweaters, actually, if there's even a hole or like stains, they actually still do pretty good, which is kind of surprising. There's a mosquito flying around. And my fifth thing is a Brandy Melville, the only one that I took from Ryan because he kept finding all the Brandy Melville and this is the one I found. She, I actually think, cut this off herself because I think yeah. I found it online and it's supposed to have kind of this same like- Sweatshirt looking- Hem. Hem on it. Well, I mean, but like she did a good job and this looks like something Brandy would like. Yeah. So like cute. And if Brandy Mabel doesn't sell, I give it to sister because yeah. she sells the toothpick. So enjoy. Okay. Next, another little Lulu Lou Lemon tank top with this really fun kind of like mesh panel in the back and the front. I feel like I've sold this style before. I know what this is. I just for the life of me like <gasps> she's gone. I just can't <laughs> think of it. That's okay. Um, what size is this? This is a size, good question. I'm gonna say size 10. It seems a little bit, well, we'll do that later. It's okay. Okay. Next is this little Madewell top, size extra small. And it's this really, really cute, like, little flannel, checkerboard, buffalo check. It's 
something, 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 something. It's not this sheer in person, I promise. Um, it's just because we're right behind the sun. We're in front of the sun. Okay. Next is this little skirt. I saw this sitting on the bin like that Which for, like, knows for like 25 minutes. Oh, wait. And I forgot. I it was Top Shop. No. And I forgot about it and I went over to that bin and said, oh, look. And I was like, oh, the duck. That's a little hairy, too. Yeah, she needs a little. Uh, Very scary. Because her, her name is. This is ASOS Denim. Little black corduroy skirt. I love a good corduroy. I really do. Um size UK 8 which I think is like a US I'm gonna say 6 so we'll throw her in the wash pile okay next is a men's item I found a few cute men's items in this trip it is a polo Ralph Lauren a Ralph Lauren size medium cashmere little quarter zip sweater um it is I don't know what I was going to say. Next is this little Athleta sports bra. She's got some pointy... She's got some... Boozy what's it? Pointy take all bitties, if you know what I mean. Um, there's a little finger dinger. Some lovely little old lady put this back and I ran over and snatched it. It's a size 36C. Um, and there's like some inspirational jargon written on the inside. Okay. That was my Cinco. Not a brand I would grab for clothes or really jeans anymore. Um, it's Paige. Paige. Definitely needs to be washed. Look at how wrinkly <laughs> that is. But Oof. I'll list this for like 15. No, that's why God gave us consignments first. Um, this Ryan couldn't wrap his head around. It's Peruvian Connection. I still think this is defective. It, no, you don't. You said you didn't. Well, I've changed my mind. Um... It's like this dyed silk top, and it's actually really pretty. Yeah, it's cute. Hmm. We have a blue Club Monaco shirt. I'm sure this was on our NOLO list, but in the bins, the rules don't apply. No, we really don't. That's okay. These are really cute. It's Levi's. They're in like excellent, excellent like new condition. They're 710, super skinny, size 29. Super cute, super nice. Super in the bins, cute. totally gonna get these. Otherwise, maybe not. Yeah, I don't think I'd get them at Goodwill. No. And a Theory, which we'll be going to the real real. Because I don't blazer. have good luck with women's blazers. Or Theory, really. That's okay. Thanks, Theory. Okay, first off for me is this little Meadow Rue, or as Debbie calls it, Meadows Rue. Size large, a little that, beaded. That should be our video with Debbie. It's just like the Debbie dictionary. Debbie saying things that Silence I Silence the noise, Meadows Rue. What else does she say? Well, she mixes up Lululemon and LuLaRoe all the time. Oh my god. I think she kind of makes this like combined name for it. I don't even know. Everything. Everything. Oh, Lou, Lou, LaRoe. Oh, yeah. She calls Lou, LaRoe, Lou, Lou, LaRoe. Anything. It's like Lou, Lou, the you dress can company, Lou, Lou, Lemon, so. and Lou, LaRoe. Debbie just throws them all in the blender. Anyway, um, I usually would try not to get Meadow, Meadow's Rue in the thrift store just because I feel like it doesn't really do all that well for me, but like, it's in the band, who cares? Um, next is this We the Free size large little top that's really cute i know this one's really cute with these like really fun little like shoulder detail patchy things on the sleeves okay next is this et toi by anthropology and I know it's newer because it says by Anthropology on it, size extra small. This may be a tunic. This is probably a tunic. The little open sides on it. And just a plain back. Oh my God, and just a plain back. Okay. Next is, oh, this was amazing. Some mom was there with her daughter and she picked this up and it was inside out. 
she kind of just like mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, looked at it and then threw it back. So I like scurried over and snatched it. It's this really, really, really cute three. If I can like hold it up, free people top. It's a little oversized. It's very oversized, and it has these really, really, really pretty kind of crochet detail. Super, super, super. Bell sleeves. This is a size small. It's super cute. Did I just see a stain? No, I see a clump of hair. <laughs> oh, that is really cute. Did you though. see that? Ew! It floated down like a ghost. Okay, um, size small. A cute little blue top of some sort. Okay, next. Ugh, kind of mad this doesn't fit me, but this like, this is really cute. Good because I make money. Um, it's not something I would typically get. It's Banana Republic medium. It's a men's. Since I've had decent luck with the Bomber Republic, jacket. Ryan's giving it a shot. It's really cute. It has like nylon sleeves and a more like kind of cottony um, body and just like a plain varsity style bomber jacket. I love this. I know. I, I think such it's a really bomber cute. jacket. Version. I think. Yeah. It's cute. And it's a medium. So I'm going to finish mine because I've only got like seven left. I have, I don't know how many. Probably a few. This. I actually thought it was really cute. Well, it's weird. So it was laying in the bin, like the slip was separate from the skirt. Like it was inside out. So I was like, oh, two boring kind of things. But then I kept seeing it like go in front of it. And I was like, oh, that's cute, the layering. And then I realized like they go together anyways. And it's actually Betsy Johnson, New York. So it's like expensive Betsy Johnson. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with that, but I guess list it. I don't know. I'll have to kind of do more research on to that. I take pride in knowing that I'm one of probably about six people that the real world has taken Betsy Johnson. The real Johnson real ones from. took Betsy Johnson from Ryan. And it's and they've like only taken it like instantly from three people it before. Was so fine. This is a Anything. very nice Club Monaco silk paneled back. A wolf. White, like, linen blazer. This makes me nervous. It's really nice, but you can tell it's probably literally never been worn because there's, like... There's near a out. hair on there. Yeah. <gasps> wow. Hi, it's me, Dr. Seuss. This is one of the only anthros I've found besides, like, the one or two I've showed you. Leaf's daughter, or whatever, however you pronounce that. Pretty cute. Leaf's daughter. I like yeah. this little, like, detailing of the embellishments. That silk... This is actually one of my favorite things that I found. It's so cute. It's J. Crew Outlet. It's like, which now this is like a slightly older tag, but it's still good. It's like five years old. Cute. I thought it was Lily. Flamingos all over it. Lily, when he first showed it to me. Yeah, it looked like Lily Pulitzer or some kind of like interesting anthro. Like mm -hmm. mage, maybe. Yeah. Um, what is this? A Lulu's. A Lulu. The only one that route. either of us found. It's a very basic like black. But, you know, these are pretty good. Flare, People need them for, like, cool. school events and, like, church. So, you know. Um, one of my other only anthros, Moulinet Sour, which okay. is what I say. Is I've heard a lot of people say Moulinet Sours or Moulinet Sewers. Good question. See, I think it's Sewers because the E's in the middle. Sours, I would think S-O-U-E-R-S. I don't know. Well, I'm not. But I'm going to say Moulinet Sewers. <laughs> Um, it does have a stain, but it's polyester. It's an oil or a grease stain, which if you didn't know, dish soap can take that out. We got dish soap. Um, it's yeah, cute. it's pretty basic, but that's okay. Second to last thing, probably the same woman because it's the same size. This Club Monaco blazer, this time in black, not with a silk panel, she but was once again, doesn't really look used. Woman. And the moment. Where is that it? everybody has been waiting for. So it's so weird because, like we said, I think in the first video, not this one, I was in a really bad mood oh, <laughs> because the first so hour mad. that we were at the bins, I kid you not, I didn't find a single thing. Like, I had an empty cart for an hour, and I was looking. Mm -hmm. So I think anyone would be in a bad mood. It was really frustrating, and Ryan has, like, a cart full. 
I always find a lot though. And like, every once like they were filling their cards. I was, mm. oh, that was not fun. No, he was not a happy kid. Suddenly Ryan says, will you watch my cart and I'll go to the bathroom? And I was like, sure. I and then I'm, so I angrily say, sure. And then I'm like digging through this bin and I feel this thing that just like, it feels like like one of those like vampire Halloween costume capes. It doesn't feel good. It feels not great. Um, and so I pick it up. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Yeah. Look. Um, you know, and I, for some reason, it. just look at the buttons. I'd even like look for a tag. It smells like a. Smells I don't know if you expensive. can see that. Probably not because it doesn't really focus. That is a shiny button. Um. <laughs> new without tag. Gucci. Gucci. Um, Gucci. don't really ask me what this is. It's the top of the bow on. So, mm. it buttons on the back. Is this thing it's made out of? No, the tag, they cut the tag out. Well, I can see why it's sheer. It buttons on the back, and it, this is like supposed to be a bow, I think. Definitely gonna do a ton of research into this. Yeah. Of course, probably best if I send it to the real real but since I'm so proud of this find I'm definitely gonna try it on Posh for a while just so I can have it in my possession for a while she might stay in the house for a little bit but <sighs> new without tag Gucci at the bins mm -hmm. what Sorry, like there's ants feeding each other cool. I'm I'm quaking okay your turn okay so beat that this is not from the bins but I'm still gonna show it off like a proud mother um, it is a Johnny was extra small, sorry, really, really, really pretty, really heavily embroidered blouse. Oh my god, I about had a panic attack when I found this. I did have it on my Instagram story, and I just wanted to show everybody. I'm very proud of her. Okay, next, this is a, what is this? intimately free people little tank top um it reminds me of the trapeze dress that you can get in like every single shape color size pattern um but this is just cute you know not the most expensive thing in the world but like i'm not mad okay a new one free people and cp shades um i have no idea what i almost said either of these people are i know who these are i have no idea what cp shades is but at the bins, why the hell not? It's like a button down. It's kind of like a corduroy feeling, but like not quite. It's like felt. Yeah, or like velour. A little bit. Um, little. Mm -hmm. Okay. <gasps> I'm shoving everything in my big bag next to me. <laughs> Some giant Ziploc. It's bag. like a. It's like a bag you like put comforters in and take all the air out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next, another free people sweater. This one is a little bit longer. Sweater dress, isn't it's it? It's kind of... Well, or is it a tunic? No, I think it's a tunic because this is like open. Like the mm. side is open. So, I don't know. Um, this is a size... I want to say medium. Extra small. Whoop. Uh, with the fun little cross in the top. And the back. And the sleeves are like... Those, Split. Those big open sleeves too. Okay. Next is a where's the tag it is a sleeping on snow which is an anthropology sweater brand that is very 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 expensive and it's this really pretty kind it's of an like, anthro brand that does really good usually and they do really not a hundred not the, the old time, ones but usually the new ones do really good um okay so this is a sweater a vest or like photo without sleeves if you want to call it that which all this like with which with all this really pretty kind of variation in knit in it okay next is another anthropology sweater it is monogram which is hwr as a monogram and it's just this really simple little black cardigan okay this is really cute Ugh, my piles are falling over okay last but not least, is a Free People a New Romantics size large, like poncho sweater looking thing. And it's pretty because it has this like, it's folded up right now, which I don't know why, but it has this like 
lace detail around the sleeve, which I think is very pretty. I don't usually find this this variety of free people too much, but when I do, it is pretty good for me. So. One more side <sighs> note, because we're done. That's all she wrote. Um, well, first off, shout out to Kim and Kristen for like hanging out with us at the bins. It was so fun. So nice. Love spending time with you guys. That was so nice yeah, to talk. Yeah, call me. When I Added some excitement to the, to the bins. Yeah. Good job. Um, and also, so, last weekend when I went to the bins, I found a blue, beautiful, vintage Christian Dior wool coat. Awestruck, shook, oh, yeah, shaking, quaking, mm -hmm. like crying, dying, everything. He was very uh, emotional. Um, which, understandable. Couldn't, like, it was insane. <sighs> With Ryan, Kim, and Kristen as my witness, the next time I went to the bins, I found this. And Kristen found one too. She found a black one. Not like the same. Hers wasn't the same style. Mm -mm. Mine was the it same was style. style. Vintage. Long, wool, beautiful. Stop. I'm jealous if you can. Wonderful. He's like, I found Gucci and Christian Dior. Yeah, yeah. so basically it was like, like. I got a bag of free peoplers. Two times ago, Christian Dior. Last time, Christian Dior. This time, Gucci. What can I say? I'm going to beat you to death with my Lululemon purse. Thanks. But yeah, that's so that's too. awesome. Um, let us know what your favorite thing is that we that we found. Yeah, 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 um, yeah. And be sure to like and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. Ring the bell to get notified whenever we put up a new video. Who sings that song? Ring, ring my bell. Be oh. Um, we might have a what's sold Saturday this Saturday. Depends on how good our sales are. We'll be at home, like at our home, so. We will? Yeah. We will. So we'll do we'll do something. Hopefully. We may it do that It should be a what's sold Saturday, but video. we'll do At some point, Ryan will do a bag repair Kim, I promise, she nagged at me, not nagged at me, very lovingly instructed me to do it, because <laughs> I've been talking about it for, for like years. Maybe that. Hopefully, don't know. Okay. Good question. But we're gonna go because this video is even longer than the last one. But and I'm hot. Thank you for watching. Yes. Bye. One more.